once again. You've lost two already. And I know she's there. And I shouldn't have engaged. I almost... Yeah, at this point, when I was coming down here, I knew she had me. Right, I knew she was going to kill me wherever I went. I could have backed down. But the, I don't know. I just wanted to do as much damage as possible. Ah, that's what I do. I get my infinity edge. That's fine. Let's look at the stats for a moment. So you can either pause the video or just have a look at the builds which people are going. Okay. Uh, you point out the reward bid, right where a new new standing. Yep, that's lovely. I should have probably bought a um invisible vision ward, yes. To um do that, but then again, is it I don't know if it was worth it because I can see us mid at the moment anyway. Because of all the minions. Maybe I should have, I don't know. But it was a while ago, so it probably would expire soon anyway. I activate my attacks too early, but that's fine. So I can use my so got a long delay. I hit off the poppy again. This time we may get it though, I'm not sure. Misses the arrow, so possibly not. No we don't. Once again, she survives. Ooh, what's going on now? Okay, we go after the um ribbon and I fire my attack. Don't get it, but she jumps away, but I can do that too, so I get her. Be especially because I now you may wonder. How if she jumps away at the same speed I can, how come I jumped further? That's because I use my ultimate and it increases the um spell like distance. I'm pretty sure that's the reason. It's the only reason I can think of. Now meanwhile. I realize I got knocked up over here. And I'm heading down because of the minion wave. It's not really a wave, but it's potential. It's potential to grow bigger. And then we're just pushing back minions at the moment, so not much is going on. Okay. Okay, only six, three, six. I like keeping things, like keeping things even. Well, not that even. Okay. As she's been killed up here by double gank by Poppy and. Tina. Riven is down got and used the old. I found that if I've ever used the old, I love them a lot. Now, just a fairly short cooldown. It means it's not an unusually short cooldown. Anyway, go for attack on her, but it doesn't out of range at the start range. So we're all going to push top bot at the moment. Bottom. Okay, stun on her. Attacks. Now I run around here just in case she's going to do her fancy jump away, but she picks up a kill. Okay, at the moment. I'm not sure if this could have pulled her in, but either way, it doesn't really matter. Now both Poppy and Sona are mid, and are almost positively coming over this way. I hit up here just to make sure that he stays away from the turret, and it hit destroyed properly. Poppy comes in. Now, I should have used my stun straight away, but I used my other attack, and I flash over. Poppy actually does go down, eventually. And he's going to pulled in, and we kill... do we kill her? Yes, we kill Avella. And they're chasing Ruben away. At this point, the um, score is 35 and 22. If you have a look at the um, uh, tabs here, Poppy has 11 kills, 5 deaths. Helen has 12 deaths, 0 kills. So they're the two opposites on this team. Now, Blitz Crank has the most kills on our team with. Uh, Again, 11 kills, and I have a nice stable 6 kills and 3 deaths with 7 An assists. Enemy has been slain. Level up the ult.
I'll probably get a bit of my voice for a bit, so just watch the gameplay. At this point, I try to run. I thought it was a bit greedy there. Because I think they will said to push top. And Poppy's after me, so I exhaust her, but she charges me. And I try to use my attacks to get away. And I E, and use my double jump again, but there's no way I'm getting away from her at this stage. She's just far too powerful. If you have a quick look at her build, she has a Trinity Force, a Virgin Dancer, and a Vampire Scepter. Hmm. Just Now uh, I have my Phantom Dancer and my Infinity Edge plus a Vampire Scepter and Beats of Swiftness. I find you can farm relatively well, with, especially early game, with the um, Q. Just wait till they get low and use the Q and you do a lot of damage to minions. You can even take out Sona and we go for Poppy. Yes. As she was killed. But more gets out of it. Just. I have the talents working at the turret, but. At this stage. Considering we get the turret alive that long, it's not so much to deal. I mean, we're good to keep it alive, obviously, but. What can you do? Now. Oh. Yes, you can farm with it with the will. And also, if you want to be fancy, that's what I was going to say. You can use your E spell to give you extra armor against the minions. When you get a huge wave fence earlier game. But it's probably unnecessary. Also, you can juggle quite well with um Riven. If you start at the walls with a life steel scepter, then go to here and smite the uh, blue rough. Then go over here. You may need um runes for that though, I'm not sure. I know I drink on Nocturne and without runes and I can do that. But as in actually at the moment I'm playing with about runes because I'm not, I'm not sure entirely. I mean I know what runes you probably should go, but I finished off these two which annoy me later before. Anyway, I'm not playing with runes. I'm playing with um, standard, not so standard. Well, my caster runes pretty much. I've got um, mana, cooldown, ability power, that kind of stuff. Anyway. We go for the gauge and we take out Irella. I'm probably going to be saying lame wrong the entire time. Anyway, no, we miss Irella. We take out Talon and kill uh, someone. Uh, kill, uh, kill I got a double skill. And I go chase down Poppy, attack twice, attack three times, boost in and get the kill. So I got three kills there. And now I'm 9, 4, and 7. Which is quite an acceptable score in my opinion. Anyway, I head back up because I'm at fairly full health. Also, red buff is very useful against, um, with, and against, I would assume, if you're on AD carry, um, Riven. But, um, that's not what I meant to say. I meant it's very useful for Riven. Here and here, I go for, um, Talon. Double kill, but he didn't double jump. What am I saying? But he, uh, gets out of there. So I head up and start to take up this turret because you may as well as many inhibitors that as possible if you're not going to push the middle. At this point I hit 18. And my build is getting there. It's not done yet, but it's getting further along. Now, again, predictive. Um, uh, thing there. Now here, this is something which really annoyed me. So I was, I got my flash up, come on, and I'm going here, thinking I'm just about to flash, right now I'm just about to flash, and I get stunned. But half a second I get stunned, and that really annoyed me, actually. Uh, yeah, that was, I don't know. Anyway, we get slain up here. I actually get slain, I get slain. Plus they all charge on Nunu and Morgana. Mumu goes down, and so there's more Morgana. So we almost get aced here. This character is the only one still alive. And he's attacking wolves at the moment. 
That's when I get my blood first. I got blood first now. I'm probably gonna head into. I forget where the build goes. There'll be a link in the description. Don't worry. Anyway, let's come on with the scores. I'm at 9, 5, and 7, which is the third house on my team out of 5, but still. I'm not playing as okay. So much. Talon is down 13, which is very cool still. And Poppy is 14. So Poppy and Morgana are battling it out for the. Poppy is just slightly less in depth though, so. It's by 1. So that's the only difference between Poppy and Morgana. Irela is doing quite good. No, 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 when I say quite good. She's got enough, she got a fair amount of kills and assists, but not quite enough to count for deaths. Riven is doing fairly well considering how much we shut her down early game. If I remember correctly. What's that talent? We're going for the kill at Sonya, and we get it obviously. I get it actually. So I've now got double kills over um, deaths that I come in here. I stun. Do I stun? Yes, I have stunned. But. That may have been used on Sona. We go for the Poppy, which is always a great idea. I'm not sure why we keep doing this. Anyway, we pull in Irella and I go for the kill again. But we just get her. I didn't get her, but we get her. I go for Talon because he's fairly exposed. I use my stun, but he disappears, which is quite annoying. Now, Vivian gets killed on their team because she ran into four guys with big swords and stuff like that. Poppy is hiding off the minions and it's pretty much a slow death at this point. We head in here and I'm about 3 quarters health. I actually stunned there because I wasn't sure if she was going to charge me. I think she may be trying to flash over. Anyway. We kill Talon and is that the end of the game. So, um, it's been the Gopin Gaming. Please like and subscribe to this video and I'll see you next time.